So how do you market on social media to get more leads and sales for your business? Well, I've personally helped hundreds of people skyrocket their social media success. And inside of this video, I'm gonna share with you my top three tips to do that starting today. So stay tuned. Hey, my name is Garrett Beery and I help entrepreneurs get more leads and sales on social media. So if you're new here, consider subscribing. So my first tip is to interconnect all your other social media platforms. So what I mean by that is, let's say you have a primary social media site that you're posting a lot on, maybe you're building up followers. Well, what you can do is use that one social media account. So let's say for example, you post a lot of Instagram pictures and you've kind of built up some good engagement. Well, you can make a post on that Instagram account to get those followers to like you know, your other sites. So sites like Facebook, uh, they can subscribe to on YouTube, they can follow your fan page etc when you start interconnecting these different social media platforms what's that's going to allow you to do is have multiple exposures for your brand for your business for your products and services and if you don't know already it takes on average about seven exposures for someone to see a business or see a product and actually feel like buying so what you're doing by interconnecting all these social media platforms is allowing you to not only build followings on all of them but by posting consistently you're getting multiple exposures so you can ensure that you're gonna get a lot more leads and a lot more sales. Okay, tip number two is understanding the posting frequency on the different social media platforms. So sites like Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, all require different amounts of posting times to best ensure your success so you don't annoy people, but you also build that no like and trust factor for your business. So just to give a rough estimate, for example, on Facebook, it's a good idea to post one to two times a day. Okay, any more than that and you're, you're posting a little bit too much and it can kind of turn people away, but anything less than that and you're not gonna really be able to build that consistent engagement. Instagram, one to two times a day is what uh, we've personally found to work best. YouTube, about two videos a week is that sweet spot if you're building up a YouTube channel. And when it comes to Twitter, you can post up to 10 times a day because it's a fast moving site when you post, the next post keeps going. So about 10 times a day on Twitter is a good amount. So my last tip to understand how to market on social media properly is to understand and listen to feedback. What I mean by this is as you're posting on these different social media sites, building a good following, you're gonna get feedback from your followers, from your audience on what type of posts and what type of content they really resonate with both. If you post something and you don't get a lot of good engagement, but you notice every single time you post a certain type of video or a certain type of Facebook post or Instagram picture, you notice you get a lot more engagement. What you wanna do is start doing that a lot more. Start to ask yourself, what about these type of posts is working? Why is my audience resonating with this? And how can I implement this in the future to really serve the audience and my followings and give them the exact type of content they're looking for. So now you know some of the best ways to market on social media, but how do you actually start turning this into consistent leads every day for your business? Well, be sure to grab my free audio training below revealing 17 ways to get leads today. I'm gonna to share with you 17 different ways that you can start generating high quality leads today for your business. All of them are simple and all but one of them are totally free methods. So if you like this video, click the like button below, share it with your friends, and be sure to subscribe. Also, I'd love to hear your feedback. Leave me a comment below what you thought of these tips, which one you're gonna go apply first, and I will see you in the next video. <music>